Kita mau prepare satu pada orang mengkat. Sige, start. Application of first order differential equations on falling objects. Kung magamit ta ay mag solve ta sa of falling objects. First to buat on is consider a falling object influenced by a gravity and an air resistance proportional to the velocity of the object. So, inote na to nga dapat ang um, gravity o ang air resistance is proportional to the velocity of the object para magamit na to niya to ang mga pang gamit na formulas. So, by using Newton's Newton's second law of motion which is F is equal to MA o gamitan ng mga substitution mo come up ta og equation nga dv over dt plus k over mv is equal to g nga ang g na to is ang gravity ang k na to kv is ang air resistance to the velocity tapos ang m is ang mass sa object so natay problem okay. ang problem na to is a steel ball weighing 1 pound is dropped from 2,500 feet with no velocity. As it falls, air resistance is equal to V over 8 in pounds where V is the velocity of the ball in feet per second. Kaninga problem, ang bato na una is, ay ang question is, find the limiting velocity. So, kwao na to ang mga given, which is ang G na to kay Dere is feet man ang giingon in feet per second. So, G is 32 feet per second squared. Ang K na to, given man dere nga, ang air resistance is equal to V over 8. So, KV man siya. So, ang K na to is equal to 1 over 8. Ang pagkuha sa mass is weight is equal to mg. Ang weight na to is 1 LB, 1 pound. Tapos, ang ato ang G is equal to 32. So, divide na to both sides by 32. Makakuha ta og M equal to 31 over 32. Kani nga mga values. Kani. Kani. So, kani. I-substitute na to siya sa kani nga equation. So, makakuha ta og dv over dt plus k which is 1 over 8 over m which is 1 over 32v is equal to g which is 32. Top, which is equal to dv over dt plus 4v is equal to 32. Muna nito siya itong equation. So, kopyahan na ito dv over dt over v so kuhaan mo siya linear first or ODE so gamitan na to siya ay pwede na to siya gamitan itong integrate kuhaan na to itong integrating factor which is equal to E in this case is to the power of 4 dt is equal to e raised to 40. Kumunan siya itong integrating factor. Kani is i-multiply na to sa itong equation. So, dv over dt multiplied by e to the 40 plus 4v multiplied by e to the 40 is equal to 32 multiplied by e to the 40. So, kaning sa left niya nga side is the one derivative d over dt sa ito ang integrating factor ay sa product sa integrating factor sa v. So, ang left side is 32E40. Ang next to button is integrate both sides. Integrate both sides. 
Titi. Titi. Ini mau cancel. Cancel dulu nih, E40 B. Angka ni, kami tanah tau U. Let U be equal to 40. And DU is equal to 4 DT. You divide na to 4 both sides. So DU over 4. So makakuha ka og I substitute na to which is 32 over 4 E40 plus C. So, i-divide na to ang both sides by E40 E40 Cancel ni. Tapos, dire, mabilin V. Cancel 32 over 4 plus C E to the negative 40. Mone to equation. Ang next na tong buhaton is kuhaon ang C. Ang kabalo mong tanga, ang initial velocity V0 is equal to 0. So, substitute na to ang equation of 0. 8 plus C is equal to 0 is equal to C is equal to negative 8. So, VT is equal to 8 minus 8 E negative 40 So, kuha ko na ito ang limit sa both sides So, limit as it approaches positive infinity sa so VT is equal to limit as it approaches positive infinity sa so 8 minus 8 E negative 40 ang equal man sa kani as magkadool ni siya ma equal rin siya to 0 kani yun niya isulat na ito ha 8 minus 8 over E40 as T approaches to positive infinity may mo siyang 0 so ang ato ang limiting velocity is equal to 8 therefore limiting velocity is 8 Feet per second. Thank you.